Next, back here at home into an accident on I-95 in Maryland, injuring more than 20 school children. Their charter bus overturned on the way to Washington, D.C. for an event marking National Police Week. And behind them on the road, another bus full of police cadets who then rushed in to help everyone. Here's ABC's David Curley. The eighth grade field trip in an instant terrifyingly turned upside down. This is a mass tragedy with at least 30 patients. Mostly students tossed about. When the bus began to uh, flip, she heard some screaming and stuff, but she thought it was all a dream. Two of those on board critically injured, medevac, two dozen others needing care. They ran anywhere from uh, head injuries, broken bones, minor bruises, things like that. Fortunately, another bus filled with police cadets was nearby, and those cadets sprang into action trying to calm the crying injured students. I haven't seen it very often, uh, but I'm very glad that they were there because they were very helpful. The bus was halfway from the Philadelphia school to a field trip in D.C. when a small sedan tried to pass the bus. That vehicle runs off the road. As the driver corrects, the car crosses the southbound lanes, clipping the front of the bus, sending it into an embankment lined with trees and throwing it and the 30 occupants onto its side. Many of the injured students treated at local hospitals have already been discharged. The driver of that small sedan, which apparently caused the accident, could face charges. David? David Curley with us tonight as well. Thank you, David.